A wonderful race, a mouth-watering affair here. The men's 100 metres backstroke, Christou and Chechon, flanked by Armstrong and Masuk. Ryan Murphy, outside of that middle four lanes, the world record holder. Eight. Robert Glinter buoyed by the win we just saw from Popovic. I'm sure the Romanian teammate. Lane one, we've got the 32 year old from Japan, Ryosoka Iri. He's uh, at his seventh World Championships, yet to win a gold, two silver, two bronze. Ryan Murphy in seven. He's the world record holder, Olympic champion from Rio, but was the bronze medalist in Tokyo last year. Johan and Doi Bruard is the swimmer here in lane number two, who was uh, disqualified in this event in Tokyo, in the semi finals. Kasri Masuk. In lane six, the 17-year-old swimmer from Poland gave that world junior record a scare last night. Here's Hunter Armstrong, 21-year-old American. He swam at the Olympics, came away with a gold medal. Watch out for the Italian, Thomas Cecchon, fourth in the Olympic Games final last year. Fourth in the 50 fly last night. Here's our fastest qualifier, 26 year old from Greece, Apostolos Christou, set a championship record in the semi final with his fourth world championships. His biggest moment. His world record standing now for six years, Away they go, Christou and Chechon in those middle lanes representing Greece and Italy. And first up, it's Ryan Murphy in lane seven. Yeah, great start from Murphy. Let's see how he wants to swim this race. It looks like he's going to attack from the start. In the middle of the pool, Chechon got away cleanly as well. And Christo above him. Watch out for Hunter Armstrong in three as well. Armstrong's just off the pace here. Here's the 50-meter world record holder, so he has got some finishing speed. Murphy, under world record pace. In front of Chechon and Chris do as they bring it home now. Ryan Murphy, the world record holder in lane number seven. He wasn't in great form in the semis. He's much better here. He continues to lead. Chechon in second place and he's after him. Chechon's finishing better. Chechon in lane number five. He's taken over from Murphy and Chechon's going to win it and it almost might be a world record. It is! Chechon with a world record. And the gold medal. What a swim by the Italian. Smashes that world mark, 51-6-0 with a moustache. When's the last time we've seen a world record broken from an unshaved swimmer going back to Spitz in 72? <laughs> wow, asserting himself 
at the top of the backstroking tree is Thomas Chech on this. Murphy, the ex-world record holder, just congratulating him. And this 21-year-old Italian, what a star he is across multiple strokes, multiple events. Murphy got away quick off the start there, was flying down the first 50. Got to give credit to the ex-world record holder for grabbing this race and doing the best he can. He still goes sub-52, Murphy, but Chechon gliding into the finish too. So many things that he could potentially improve on. There's another goal for the Italian men. He has taken a quarter of a second off the old world record. Thomas Chechon over... So, she's been on the scene. What a talent she is. And now she's world champion. So Hunter Armstrong, another of the newer names from the American team. It's always such a big team. There's always a good mix of those who have been there for years and continue to perform at the highest level and they keep bringing in the future as well. And Hunter Armstrong represents that. Yeah, he beat Ryan Murphy at the trials and broke the world record in the 50, so certainly one to watch out for the 21 year old and um, assumes a personal best time there to break 52. So Ryan Murphy it is this time with the silver medal. He lost his world record along the way but he showed great grace Yeah, one of the nicest guys in swimming is Ryan Murphy. He's a veteran now at 26. I wouldn't have thought after last night's semi that he was capable of going 51-9, but he produced his best tonight in the final. Thomas Chechon announced as the world champion. And in doing so, he becomes not only the first Italian to win this event at the world championships, but the first Italian to medal of any kind in this race that dates back to the first edition of the world championships 49 years ago. The world record, 51.6 taking a quarter of a second off Murphy's old mark.
Thomas Church, I'm not showing a great deal of emotion, but I'm sure he's feeling it. He's taking it all in his stride. Is the 21 year old Italian and again he's got a mustache he's unshaved hair on his chest when's the last time you've seen that anybody in rome break a world record with a mustache not from my memory mm. no you mentioned mark spitz Thorpe, in, popov no never. 19, 1972 uh, it's a long time ago isn't it uh, mark spitz it didn't slow him down too much at the munich olympics it's got to be said but what i mean it's a mustache but you know can you can you put that in in terms of fractions of a second what's it worth oh to actually put it into time you can't i mean he's he's got hair on his chest